Rob, congratulations on the new role. What uh, made you decide to want to come to the Waratahs? Well, getting back into Super Rugby is very, very exciting for me. And the Waratahs, as um, we've discussed, has got an immense amount of talent. And um, it's, it's a side that um, has a lot of potential. And um, it was very exciting for me and, and invigorating to be considered to be someone that might be able to harness that and I guess overwhelmed with the with the ability to join an organisation like the Waratahs and try to assist them in, in being the best team they can be. You've coached all around the world, Ireland, Japan, um, in New Zealand a little bit. What do you think you can bring, particularly from your experiences at Munster to New South Wales? Yeah, I th well, I guess coaching as you mature as a coach, um, your own ego dissipates and it becomes all about um, the growth of the individuals and it's about seeing um, others achieve their desires and uh, that's really important for me. It's, a, it's part of the job that I really love is um, coaches and players and, and support staff all, I guess, unifying and, and, uh, and achieving something that you know, individually no one can achieve but together we can, we can do something special. And obviously, you know, with any squad, there's always a balance of developing younger players and, you know, bringing in maybe players from outside. What are you looking at the Waratahs squad? What would you like to add before the 2020 season? Well, 80% of the, the um, squad is already in, in situ. So th there's not a lot of room, but there, there's a couple of strategic areas. You know, we're, we're discussing around, uh, a, I guess, a, a robust front rower to give us a little more stability at, at scrum time. Um, potentially a, a robust um, operative in the in the forward pack somewhere to give us some go forward at difficult times, and uh, and an outside back of of class that in the in the last few years the Waratahs have had some outstanding outside backs that have given finishing quality and um, which you know gives confidence to the to the general attack. In saying that, we've got to make sure that we're giving. Uh, clear opportunity to the young boys that are there and uh, the ones that really want to drive through and put their hands up and say pick me through the work that happens in the pre-season is, um, is also a massive priority.